everybody, it's your girl Story Time with Miss Ty. Just checking in with you today. Happy Hump Day! Hope everybody's day is great. So today I want to, sh I will be sharing with you all a short story called um, "It's Just a Gift." So sit tight. I hope you guys enjoy. And please, 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 do not forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell to make sure you can receive an update on all things Story Time with Miss Ty. Now I know you're not gonna want to miss anything, right? Right? Of course not. So make sure to hit that bell. Let's jump on in. Okay. Frank is a studly pigeon who flies all day. He flies and he flies and he flies far, far away. He finally lands on a branch and stares into the open until he discovers a mild-mannered pigeon who appears soft-spoken. Say, girl, would you come around my way? Well, all right, she replies and comes right away. Well, don't get too comfy, girl. I won't be here long. It's just a gift I have bringing women along. They chatted and they chatted, talked about this and that. Minutes later, Frank was in the wind, flying like a bat. Frank's wings screeched to a halt as he flew past a farm, where he saw a girl cow standing all along. Say, girl, you looking good. Look at those thighs. Moo, excuse me, the cow said in surprise. You looking good enough to eat. Can I have a minute of your time? I was eating grass, but I guess that's fine. It's just a gift, girl. I won't take up too much of your time. So Frank and the cow talked. He flew as she walked. He whispered in her ear. She giggled, then sneered. So when am I going to see you again? When the moon comes and leaves, I'll be back on your sleeves. But for now, I'm off to fly with the bees. Frank flew and he flew while his confidence grew. He saw a girl cat and said to himself, I got to get with that. Her tail swayed high as the pretty feline sashayed by. Say, girl, you not going to say hi? Boy, please, goodbye, she replied. Well, I see a mighty feisty, well, I see you're a mighty feisty feline. I seen the way your tail was moving from behind. Look, little man, you couldn't handle it, okay? Now move on along and get out my way. Okay, okay. But before I go, I can't, but, be okay, okay, but before I go, can I come and see you later? You know, on the low low? As the cat turned to face Frank, a crowd gathered around. The pigeon, the cow, and a bear who was brown. Frank, use like a player. Use a little player, they all began to scream out. Ladies, ladies, please. It's just a gift, he recited, before quickly flying to leave. All right, everybody. I hope you guys enjoy my poem. Look, see, it's not a poem. It's a short story. Hello. Hello. I hope you guys enjoyed this short story about Frank, the um, player pigeon, who was flying all about. Um... Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. What kind of stories do you guys like? Is it fun stories? Is it humorous stories? Is Frank too much as a pigeon? Is he a pigeon who's out of control or just having a little bit of fun? Um, please let me know your comments below. I'd love to hear from you. And remember, my upload days are Sundays and Mondays, so please join me. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Storytime with Miss Ty. Until next time for now. Oh, there's always another story to tell. But for now, I bid you goodbye.